People think about or talk about, you have pancreatic cancer, you're gonna die. So you go into immediate shock. And you start doing things that you're preparing for that event when that event isn't necessarily true. There's hope now. There's a lot of hope. Everybody in that room at this meeting is a survivor. Uh, my name is Michael Francis. I'm from Phoenix, Arizona. The Cena Magowitz Foundation saved my life. I was diagnosed as stage three on the day after Thanksgiving, 2018. So I was admitted immediately, and the next day I was diagnosed with adenocarcinoma, pancreatic cancer. Well, when I was admitted to Honor Health, uh, they put me in the type two trial. And over a period of time, I came to understand that that trial was being funded by the Cena Magowitz Foundation. Once I found that out, I made a personal effort to find out everything I could about them. After I was diagnosed at the first Cena Magowitz meeting, I stood in front of everybody in that room and I told them, I just want time to see my granddaughter go to college. That's the most important thing to me. So they gave me hope that I was able to do that. And now, today, I'm getting ready to see my second grandchild go to college. And as you get a little bit older, those kind of things become much more important. And all the rest of these things in the world become much less important. But without the foundation, uh, I was told by a major hospital chain that I would went to originally that my lifespan would last three years or less. I stand before you today going on five years. That's a pretty big change. I traveled from Phoenix, Arizona, and I traveled to the ends of the earth for this because it's right now very important to me and to all pancreatic cancer patients.